Dear friends, welcome to Daily Video Vocabulary. Download our new Android application to stay updated and track your progress better. If you have any suggestions tell us in the comments below. We will respond to each and every comment that is posted. In today's episode we will be going to explore the Hindu's editorial marks and standards, the need for a better evaluation system, for words with rich vocabulary. Read the editorial given in the description to get maximum exposure. Let's look at the first word of the day. Substantive. The word substantive is an adjective. The direct synonyms of substantive are essential, real. In general context the word substantive means having a separate and independent existence. Inessential. Option are some of the terms referring to the opposite meaning to the word substantive. We will see a few examples to understand the word substantive better. Example 1. If the government is committed to meaningful and substantive talks they have to show that. Example 2. But it is important to note that substantive discussions of issues rarely entered into five points political contests. The second word of the day is Ambiguity. The word ambiguity is a noun. The direct synonyms of ambiguity are Uncertainty. Unclearness. In general context the word ambiguity means Uncertainty or inexactness of meaning in language. Certainty. Clarity. Are some of the terms referring to the opposite meaning to the word ambiguity. We will see a few examples to understand the word ambiguity better. Example 1. The same person will tolerate ambiguity in one situation but not in another. Example 2. The actor's political ambiguity resolves itself, here at least, in a genuinely radical portrayal. The third word of the day is Parity. The word parity is a noun. The direct synonyms of parity are Equality. Balance. In general context the word parity means The state or condition of being equal especially regarding status or pay. Inequality. Contrast. Are some of the terms referring to the opposite meaning to the word parity. We will see a few examples to understand the word parity better. Example 1. He feels Australian wines have a long way to go in reaching parity with France. Example 2. This has improved conditions for secondary teachers while circumventing the requirement of pay parity with primary teachers. The fourth word of the day is Litigation. The word litigation is a noun. The direct synonyms of litigation are Action. Case. In general context the word litigation means The process of taking legal action. Compromise. Accord. Are some of the terms referring to the opposite meaning to the word litigation? We will see a few examples to understand the word litigation better. Example 1. The company wishes to avoid litigation. Example 2. The dispute went to litigation. The last word of today's episode is Stifle. The word stifle is a noun. The direct synonyms of stifle are Restrain. Silence. In general context the word stifle means Restrain, a reaction, or stop oneself acting on, an emotion. Encourage. Boost. Are some of the terms referring to the opposite meaning to the word stifle? We will see a few examples to understand the word stifle better. Example 1. I stop trying to stifle it when I realize that about half the people in the audience are chuckling.
Example 2. Today's technology also can interfere with forming solid alliances, which can stifle excellent ideas. Friends, did any of these words influence you to use in your day-to-day -day life? Comment the sentences you have managed to form with today's words. To watch all the episodes of Daily Video Vocabulary and to better your English language skills, subscribe to our channel. I will see you again tomorrow with new set of words. Till then bye and take care.